The maximum number of meals is N. On Friday, he needs to have N over 4 at one event and N over 6 at another event. So we want to find out that total. N over 4 plus N over 6 mean to add these two fractions, we're going to need a least common denominator. The least common denominator of 4 and 6 is 12. So I'm going to multiply this one by 3 over 3, multiply this one by 2 over 2, and this will give me 3n over 12 plus 2n over 12 equals 5n over 12. And that is the exact number of meals he has to have ready on Friday. We want to know which one of these sums equals 5n over 12. Let's look at them one at a time. Choice A. We have a 3 and a 12 in the denominator. Multiply the common denominator, of course, would be 12. So multiply this one by 4 over 4. So we get 4n over 12 plus n over 12 equals 5n over 12. So this one works. A is one of the answers. Now B. We have denominators of 5 and 30, so 30 would be the least common denominator, so this one's going to get multiplied by 6 over 6, so we're going to get 6n over 30 plus 7n over 30 equals 13n over 30. That does not simplify, and this does not equal 5n over 12. These two are close in value, but they are not equal. And so this one does not work. B is not one of the answers. Now let's look at C. The least common denominator of 6 and 15 would be 30. And so we're going to multiply this by 5 over 5. We're going to multiply this by 2 over 2. This will give us 5n over 30 plus 8n over 30 equals 13n over 30. So ironically, C gives the same value as b, but both of them are wrong. Neither one of them equals 5n over 12, and so this answer does not work. c is not one of the answers. Now let's look at d. The least common multiple of 8 and 24 is 24, so we're going to multiply by 3 over 3. This will give us 3n over 24 plus 7n over 24. 3 plus 7 is 10. We get 10n over 24. Cancel a factor of 2. We get 5n over 12. This one actually works. So D is one of the answers. Now let's look at E. The least common multiple of 18 and 36 is 36. So we're going to multiply numerator and denominator by 2 here. So we're going to get 2n over 36 plus 13n over 36. 2 plus 13 is 15. We get 15n over 36. Cancel the factors of 3. We get 5n over 12. So that one also works, and e is also a possible answer. So reviewing, B and C did not work, but A, D, and E are all answers. So A, D, and E are all answers to this question.